Welcome back to another live tutorial everyone. In this one I'm going to quickly show you how to permanently remove the default end screen. Anytime you start a CapCut project you can remove it by simply deleting it, but I'm talking about removing it from every project that you ever create. You can see that I've got several projects already started below. If I tap on the plus sign to add a clip and tap on add, I'll just wait for the clip to load. If I play the clip, watch what happens. The clip will play normally, and this is great. But as the clip finishes playing, you notice the default end screen right here. Of course, I can simply select on it to delete it and continue on. But I would like to find a way to permanently remove this end screen from all the projects that I ever create. Since I use CapCut quite a bit, in all of my tutorial videos. This is because there are no paid features or in-app purchases. All of the features available in CapCut can be used completely free. I'm going to back out of this project and actually delete it. I'll tap on the three dots and tap delete and then confirm the deletion. Next I'll tap on the settings icon up here and this brings up the settings. And the setting that you're looking for is the add default ending. There's a little switch to the right of it. Just simply turn that off. And tap on discard when it asks you if you want to discard the ending. And you'll see that the switch next to keep default ending is now turned off. I can close the settings and now I'll start another new project. And I'll add a couple of different clips to this one. Watch what happens if I tap on the play icon. The first clip will play. This is just some stock footage I got from pixabay.com. Then we move into the second clip, which is actually a demonstration of the motion tracking feature that was just recently added to CapCut. There's a similar feature in Video Leap, but in Video Leap, that is a paid feature and you have to have a pro subscription to use it. Notice what happens as the clip ends. There's no default ending. So now I can add one of my own and then export it. Let's do that now, just for demonstration purposes. I'll just wait for the export to finish. Once it's done, you can find the completed video inside your camera roll, which of course will be the last thing that you recorded. Please tap that thumbs up icon to like the video. Consider subscribing to the channel for more videos like this, usually pre-recorded but occasionally live. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.